Hey, today we're talking about the different moods of Gojo Satoru. <laughs> First, we have Happy Gojo. We usually see Gojo in a happy mood. He is always smiling and joking around. Gojo is happy when he is spending time with his students Yuji, Megumi, and Nobara. <laughs> Next, Angry Gojo. Gojo rarely gets angry. Gojo gets really angry when he finds out that Kenjaku has taken over Ghetto's body. <laughs> Next up is Bully Gojo. Gojo loves to bully Utahim. He often teases her. Gojo bullies Utahim by calling her teacher's pet. Also Gojo bullies Jogo by calling him weak. <laughs> then, we'll move on to sad Gojo. Gojo is rarely sad. But he does have moments of sadness, especially when he thinks about his past. Gojo gets sad when he remembers Rika and friendship with Ghetto. <laughs> After that, childish Gojo. Gojo can be childish at times, especially when he is around his students. Also, Gojo loves to make different faces. <laughs> Next up is Psycho Gojo. Gojo is a very powerful jujitsu sorcerer, and he can be quite ruthless when he needs to be. Gojo kills Hanami without any hesitation in Shibuya Incident Arc. <laughs> Last but not the least, Scared Gojo. Gojo is the strongest jujutsu sorcerer, so he is rarely scared. However, there are a few things that do scare him. At the end of the Hidden Inventory Arc, Ghetto changes and tells Gojo that he has his own path and this scares Gojo. <laughs>